Hello? Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> Dude, I can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> this, is, this was this was a trip. How's it going, everyone? Oh my gosh. Um, Junebug and Walt here. Your your yeah. favorite content creators slash and engineers slash general Master students cool, cool, like, uh, guys uh you know yeah. best friends best of friendos all right let's not go here we it. are <laughs> <laughs> hey come on man um <laughs> yeah we got a fun we got a fun block coming up for you guys i hope you guys are enjoying the alston melee bender so far it has been a treat to watch all of this uh, amazing melee content and it's really great to be a part of this with you june um you and me have a little bit of a of a little game that we got going on for these next few sets that's um, true we're gonna try to make it a, a little drinking game I, what are the rules of this Did we yeah all right so that? here here's what i think we should do and, and we'll let chat intervene if they if they encourage our <laughs> our poor decision making so june has some seltzers going on i got yeah. i made myself a moscow mule because i i had vodka in my house right, um see. what i think we do is we have one of us like you or me will pick who we think is going to win this next upcoming set and then the the person who loses gets pick for the next set you know so that way like it's okay. a bit more even it does and, that make sense and then what is the like is it just like a chug or just like a, a yeah big... like loser drinks i don't know we'll keep it mm -hmm. casual <laughs> okay loser loser drinks kind of like kings <laughs> yeah like classic yeah game. um okay for this match i have got <laughs> Ah shit! <laughs> yeah, so we got Gatsu versus Zealot for this upcoming one. Um, I think Gatsu is probably who I would have picked. Also, however, um, I I don't have a lot of information on Zealot specifically, so I wonder. All I know about Zealot really is that he's good at volleyball because he won the volleyball tournament yesterday. Okay, all right, that could go. That could go the distance. Actually, that might be what we need to counteract twenty GX. So. You know, here we go. It looks like game one is going to be right away on Pokemon Stadium here. I, I love the dash up grab to to call out like the, the dash dance there. A, a lot of Falcons might just go in with like approaching aerial. Well, he does it anyway there. But uh, dash up grab is really good for calling out dash dance. Try and not get uh, like whiff punished for an approaching. Sure. Ooh. Oh, that's like four. Oh, man, I'm drinking. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> No, Zealot's super good though, so I'm wondering yeah. what uh, kind of tricks he has up his sleeve right now. It looks like Gatsu is kind of getting into more of a flow right now of where he's going to follow up with grabs, but he might actually lose his stock first if Zealot keeps up this corner pressure. Really good, yeah, really good pressure, uh, corner pressure here from Gatsu, I think. Hasn't yeah. give Zealot a chance. Yeah, it's throwing out up air, up air, just every single hitbox, and then you can't really approach it and take center in any really reasonable way. So first blood to Gatsu. We'll see if Zealot can answer right back. Nice wait. Oh. I actually love that wait so much because we've been seeing so much of the uh, like the S2J air dodge to stage, I think is what people have been calling it because of uh, his Galint run. Uh, Gatsu goes for the air dodge on stage there. Zealot just waits it out, grabs, gets the simple follow up and oh makes it a little bit more complex <laughs> on this one. Yeah, Zealot's style seems to be super strong against Falcon. I, I like the adaptation that Gatsu has, has been doing with these run-up grabs, but like the default flowchart Zealot has against Falcon seems really tough. Wow, like, yeah, perfect. Spacing hitboxes outside his range, dash dancing at that overshoot aerial range. Like, yeah, su super good. Because if, if Falcon does that, like, approaching me, you, you kind of have, like, a bit of it react. Oh, my God. I, I feel like that shouldn't work. Like, yeah. especially given the fact that Zealot waited, but yeah, I mean, I Gatsu figured it out. He definitely missed the sweet spot, so. <laughs> Reaction tech chase stomp. Yeah, that's so. the second time, too, uh, Gatsu's caught Zealot rolling in off of the grab. Oh my. What? <laughs> okay. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, yeah, super solid follow-ups here with the ass assist of the platform, but as we speak, the platform's helping out Gatsu figure out where Zealot's going off of that tech, and he's got all the pressure in the world. What? 
Uh, the side Bs have been getting a lot of mileage in the online. I hate that Raptor boost so much, dude. It, it like, because you so always awful. think you're going to get it, yeah. <laughs> Approaching I Okay, okay. Come on, Zelda, let's go. Got High stakes match right now. I really need uh, need you to pull through here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, I think it's over. Oh, what? Wait, okay. I can't believe it's close. It's this. close. This is super sketchy, though, right? Like one stomp yeah. or yeah, that <laughs> we'll do it. <laughs> I, I like oh, the attempt at getting out of the corner there. Um, Gatsu had been like covering center with up airs, nares. So yeah, yeah. it was like a good little like adaptation from Zealot to be like, okay, maybe this time he'll let me dash through. But Gatsu also adapting, saying I'm going to space of a couple of these in place. <laughs> Yeah, um, for sure. So, so what do you think he's looking at for counter picks here uh, against Falcon? I mean, the the meme has kind of been, and we said this earlier odd. on the stream with FOD, yeah. right? So, I don't yeah. know if that's like what they're gonna default to still, or or what. Oh, okay. well, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> yep. I, I I don't like this stage against Falcon, honestly. But uh, why here, is that? here's a few reasons why. Um, Stomp really good on FOD. Um, mm -hmm. You get a lot of edge cancels on Stomp. A lot of so you're saying you don't like it as the counter picker? Yeah, I don't like Falcon. it against okay. Falcon. Oh, what? <laughs> um, yeah, Falcons also practice their movement <laughs> more so, I feel like, than most other characters. Um, it's it's almost fetishized having good movement with Falcons. So Wait, like, you're saying Melee isn't a purely theoretical game <laughs> with no impact on <laughs> human <laughs> interaction whatsoever? It's, it's the Falcons have really figured it out. They're, they've removed the human element. <laughs> oh, he um, might. Yeah, no human element. Stomp here probably kills too. What? Well, uh, I think he. Yeah, it was a weird spacing, but I, I do think that Zealot would have been able to drift in onto stage no matter what there. Wow, just hard callouts. It, it nets so much damage in this matchup, just like raw smash. Yeah, and the up tilts like that underneath the right platform are where the stage maybe gets a little bit sketchy for Falcon, right? Because there's not really a safe spot for him to land at that point. And Zealot's been playing super duper patient in terms of kind of picking his spots and finding good openings. Ugh. Yeah, again with these like short hop knees in place, calls out a lot of approach angles. Like, Gats just going for these really cool mix-ups off the stomp, too. Mm -hmm. He's not necessarily just doing the spamming stomp through platform, which is like the noob falcon trap. Uh, he's like doing a lot of double jumps, a lot of different drifts. Hey, don't say that to me. I fall for that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, <laughs> back to the match. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, patience here from Zealot nets him a bit more percent than probably just the uh, up air up smash, and we'll see if he can close out stock from it. Oh my god, <laughs> well, are well, you well, serious? <laughs> <laughs> that feels so bad when to be on the receiving end of that. I, like, you got I called know. out from it, across it the stage. It works at every level of play, which is the most frustrating thing, I think. <laughs> mm -hmm. That being said, though, I mean, again, Zealot's keeping it very, very even right now. But Stray Knee has me sweating a little bit. Yeah. Gatsu. Oh, what? Playing really well. <laughs> Again with these run up grabs. Oh, oh my god! I, I got mixed there. I, I that was know. disgusting. The, where it came to this, the stomp distance and then the cross. I'm taking a drink for that one. Okay, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait. I think it's best. To I mean, hey, no, cheers, buddy. <laughs> like, it's okay. not, that was, uh, a, a yeah, that was a, like, you know, if anything but a good combo, it was a disgusting DI mix up. Holy yes. moly. Yeah, yeah. Talk that about was, like, it. Well, why, why was it so <laughs> disgusting? <laughs> Just like everything. Like, you, mm. like the reverse knee at the end, the, the, yeah. fight. oh, my God. I can't. That was. I that was really no good. No idea how that knee reversed. I was like, "What?" <laughs> I, I definitely yeah. would have gotten di trapped there. And here I was about to say, actually, right before Gatsu got that super nutty uh, mix-up on Zealot, uh, he kind of like completely conceded center too to start that off. Like he crossed him up across his shield and ran to corner, and Zealot yeah. was in a super good position there to start it off. But Gatsu finds the opening and you know puts him in a combo video for today. Oh no. Yeah, unfortunate phantom. Yeah, I, I think one of the, the strong things about Falcon is how easily he can like 
figure out like okay i'm in center stage i'm in i'm on the edge of stage i'm center stage like he he is super fast and want to uh, see me run to the legend back want to see me do it again <laughs> I like that uh, wow. Zealot went for the jump in the corner there. If he did a spot dodge or a wake-up shine, that uh, that he would have beaten it. Um, sure. But Gatsu still beat co covering um, edge guard there. Oh my gosh, that's such a rough position to be in. Platform hopefully helps him out there, and it does. Oh, the drift. Yeah, I'm wondering, uh, you know, because Zealot has been showing, like, a, okay. a lot of good reserve overall in terms of just kind of, like, waiting his decisions out and stuff like that. I wonder if maybe he just needs to slow it down and just grab ledge, wait, and see what happens when Godzi returns back to stage. Yeah, yeah. I, I think Shine Stall wait, like, definitely would pay off a lot. Um, yeah, that, that recovery is super strong, but then he, he side beats the center. Um, Got Gatsu definitely, like, banking on you going center stage. Um, yeah, slight miscalculation out of uh, Zealot. Probably looking for the ledge there. Uh, doesn't quite get it, and Gatsu's going to go up a full stock here. Oh. Oh, my. <laughs> that, that, was a, that was a gentleman to catch slide off. I, genius. Actually. <laughs> oh, he's so sick. But oh, okay, please tell me that mattered. Come on. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Th that was so important. smart. Oh my god, 2,000 IQ, please. What? Oh my god, what a survival. And he's on the other side of the stage. Oh. Falcon, baby. <laughs> that was... I want to see me do it again. <laughs> <laughs> that was insane by Zealot. Like, so unfortunate that he didn't yeah. find the kill there. Because just like, what a smart recovery. He he kind of caught on that Gatsu was going for that drift out knee. Every <laughs> single time he caught Zealot off stage. Just waits it out, shines him. You know, unfortunate that he was down a stock. Otherwise, maybe you just take the stock trade there. But... <laughs> Shades of um, Leffen, Leffen H box. I think was yeah. the first time we saw that at the high level. The the counter shine on a on a recovery. Wow, super fast shine to the platform. Doesn't really amount to too too much. And Zealot's on his winner side stock for this tournament. Okay. Oh, ooh, I like that. Up tilts, up tilts, super strong against Falcon. Wow, yeah, Zealot's so much pressure, too. That should do it, right? Yeah, this should be an easy edge guard. Wow. Zealot might put one on the board here. Come on, buddy. <laughs> do it for Walt. <laughs> just for all the marbles here. <laughs> oh, just raw grab? Okay, yeah. Okay, so that was the, uh, like a third or fourth time probably this set now. Gatsu's reading the uh, tech roll back with Stomp. Oh, this is huge. Oh, Amazing. The Aang? The Aang. The, the last airbender. <laughs> the last Firefox, probably, of the set. God damn it. That's, that's it. Oh, oh, oh okay. okay no. Wait. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, wow, come on. <laughs> God, see with that slight delay there. Yeah. Right, take, take a drink, Walt. Take All a right, drink. Right, right. <laughs> slight, slight delay there. Gave him time to call out that full hop. Um. That it was a really good position because like Gatsu could could have been waiting out a spot dodge, could have been waiting out a, a full hop sh like a shine, just just waiting for some sort of panic option. Yeah, yeah. And um, he jumped, you know. So it jumped. Yeah, so. I mean Gatsu kind of the king of patience. Uh, <laughs> if we exclude Wizrobe, I think in that group of Falcon <laughs> players. So yeah, of course, kudos to him though. Three zero victory. But you know, Zealot's not out of the event just yet, and. I mean, honestly, all of those games were really close. So I think he yeah. could potentially have a pretty good run on his hands. Um, so what what, <clears throat> what game do we have coming up next? 